emphasis on Lawyers and civil society activists have strongly condemned the government's plot to arrest and charge journalists accused of overstepping their mandates after obtaining CCTV footage of the Westgate terror attack. The East African Law Society chairman, James Mwamu, says Inspector General of Police David Kimayo should first lodge a complaint with the Media Council if aggrieved before arresting the journalist. If the Inspector General has uh, reasons to believe that this uh, reporting was badly done that they did not give accurate report. The first action that it will take is to report the matter to the Media Council. The Media Council will then investigate based on the information that it has. Then after uh, doing that, if it is uh, proved uh, that really that there was um, misreporting, then an action will be taken. Um, but to ask them to report to show where they got the information from is not helping issues because the issue is whether that information is correct but what the inspector general should have done is to produce another cctv and say you what you produced is not correct this is the correct version Mwamu says in the absence of an official government report on the Westgate attack and security operation, the media was justified to exercise its right of informing Kenyans. Kimayo announced yesterday that he has issued orders for the arrest and the prosecution of two TV journalists accused of overstepping their mandate after obtaining CCTV footage of the security operation. When are they going to tell us that, look, now we are opening up the place so that you see what actually happened? Many, many questions that Kenyans are asking are not being answered. That is why you find that uh, uh, we would rather believe um, what comes from the media than what comes from the police. Uh, because you, you now realize that you were told that some blanket was burning, then now we discovered it's a bomb. So it is important that uh, that place be opened as fast as possible. And then these forensic experts will tell us that uh, how long is it going to take them to go through this rubble. The National Commission on Human Rights has also condemned the planned arrest and prosecution of journalists. I'm Angela Moirore for Capital TV.